Hey everybody, welcome back. Ruben with Texas All Water Fishing, and tomorrow morning I'm gonna hook up with a friend of mine, Eric. We got a uh, we have a small window of opportunity to get out there, do a little wade fishing. We're gonna hit up Sea Wolf Park. I'm gonna be throwing primarily gulp. Uh, I'll probably start off on a tandem and then maybe switch to a single later. But wish me luck, cause last time I went out there I got skunk. So hopefully this time the flounders will be there and I'll be able to hook up. All right, we're going to start the day off with a little bit of gulp action. Hopefully, hopefully we can find a few. Got like five bites on the back of my neck. Dude, I just scared one. Look. Yep. Yep. See if he comes back. Here you go. Oh, it's a little guy. Yeah, I just had a little guy on. A lot of times what they'll do is they'll just latch on and they won't really commit and won't really take the hook. So I uh, gave him a few seconds, but um, he didn't uh, he really do nothing with it held in his mouth and well you saw the result he got off but feel good to feel that tug yeah a lot of times when you're if you're new to fishing for flounder um a lot of times you just what you want to do is just bounce it off the bottom or you can reel it real slow just drag it off the bottom i i tend to go for the bounce though and um you just feel sometimes you just feel stuck like you're just all of a sudden you're just like you're hung up caught on something just give it a few seconds do a little 10 15 second countdown and then just uh just set set your hook real hard and um hopefully there'll be a flounder in the end we just saw a dolphin chunk of flounder that was uh pretty funny he picked him up and threw him it looked like he threw him twice i heard they do that i've never seen it but um that is pretty cool stuff. I just wish I caught it on video for you guys so I wasn't recording. Dang it, Ruben. I put a thump, I put a thump, come on. I need it. My goodness, it's like the smallest one ever, but you know what? This is my small one. It has been all day. All day? You have no idea. I've never been so happy to catch a little a little guy before in my life. But this, this is uh, you know still kind of early in the run here. I'm let this guy go. So we're gonna walk this little stretch back, and I think we're gonna head and go across the other side of the water. I'm gonna make Eric go play in the mud with me. Go see if we can find something else on that side. Over on the main channel side? Yeah, on the main channel. He's not doing nothing with it. It might just be a rock. But I don't know. Nope, small. Felt good though. Little under 15. Huh? Little under 15. This guy right here. Little under 15 inches. He's a skinny guy. Got him on that. Church True Scope. Little guy, we're gonna let this guy swim on. Get a bigger one, it'd be great. Either way, I'm gonna have a camper. That is one for the day. 
one slot. You know, walking back over here from that side to this side, Eric kicked four and I kicked one. So they're here. They just they just have lockjaw, you know, for whatever reason. They're just not biting, they're not committing, you know. Promised land, huh? Double up! Ah, it's a little guy. Mine's a little guy. Oh, I got smashed in the face again. Put that one in your box. He's swap. You got to take it home, huh? I want to measure this guy just for fun. I know he's going to be undersized, but I'm going to do it just for fun real quick. Let's see here. All right, so from here to here. Yeah. 13 and a half. I knew he was going to be under, but... You know what? I'm not I'm not being picky today. Pink gope. Nice little guy. He's gonna live. To swim another day. He's gone. He's out of here. Here. So when you got him like this, the best thing to do is don't go to the top, the bottom jaw measure from the from the top i mean you got a little bit to play but they can really get that top jaw lifted out so 16 eric got us yeah 16 incher nice here we go 16 nice. incher last cast let's see all right serious last cast Last one. This is a lucky one right here. All right, so that's to do it today. Rumo with Texas All Water Fishing. Out here with Eric. You can check him out. His link is below in the descriptions. You know, we came out to Sea Wood Park. We fished both sides of it. Um, you know, I mean, well, you saw what I caught today. It was kind of a slow day, a grind for myself. I saw Eric and several other guys hooking up, but it just wasn't in my cards today. But if you haven't fished Sea Wood Park, this is a great time of year to come out here and try your luck. Um, just have some warning, you know, there there are some crowds that come out here. It gets a bit crowded on the weekend, so um, even during the week. I mean, today is midweek, and we, it's kind of a lot of people out here. But anyway, uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification button, let you know next time I upload a video. Until next time, hopefully y'all catch me hooking up. Thanks.